Hi there, so here I am in um, QGIS 3 to, yeah, 3 to 8. Um, and what I want to do is show you the copy and paste styles, how they kind of work and how they can save you um, quite, a, quite a lot of time really. They're very, very simple tools, but you may not be aware of them. So this is a quick demo about how to use them. As what I've got here, I've got some sort of land classification here. So if I look at this stuff, this is the Korean um, land cover. So you can see I've got these coloured uh, polygons there, sort of multi-part stuff. As I zoom in, I've even got some labelling. So yeah, there's some code 231 and it's the um, hectares for that. So that's pastures. So you can see that code in there. So this legend, let's get, get rid of that one uh, panel. You see this legend is quite complicated. There's quite a lot in there, a lot of codes used. So um, and indeed, I've got this labelling going on. Um, so I'll just zoom out a bit. Now, what I'm going to do is just select some features. I'll just do a radial select. OK, I'll just do it so there's a few colours in there, uh, a few records. So that's gone and selected um, some polygons from this vector um, Korean land classification data set, which is a, a geo package. Uh, like I said, with all this symbology, this thematic. So I've got this selection. So if I now export the selected features, and let's just call it D temp style demo. Okay, for want of a, I'll, I'll leave everything else. Um, I'm not, not fussed about the rest of it. You can see what, when you save a selection, it, it, it gives a kind of default style. It's just got this weird green color. And um, I'll just turn off vector, the main file. And, and of course, I haven't got the labels as well. Now, I know that the schema of this, if you look at attributes, is exactly the same because it's come, come from the table. So I know I've got this code 18. This code is the, I think this is 2018 data. That's why it says 18, I think, I think. Anyway, so I've got this code, which is classification. So this is where the thematic symbology was done. And I've got this area hectares, which is where the label comes from. So I know the schema is exactly the same. So what you can do is go to your uh, layer of uh, that has your symbology and everything else. Go to style, copy, and I can copy all style cat categories, just everything, or I can just say, take the symbology. And now when I go to my um, sample data set, where I just did the radius search, and then I can go to style, paste style, and you see how these are grayed out because they're not copied, but symbology is available. So if I click on symbology, I now get all the colors through. If I look at this drop down now, see all the colors have come through. The legend has been created for me all in just a copy and paste. But in fact, um, this isn't quite exactly the same because when I zoom in, I don't get the labels. Well, if I go back to my main um, layer here where I got the data, I can copy style. Again, I can just do all, all categories and just copy it all in one go. Um, so, uh, but you can see here, you see I've got labels. So I can copy the label sort of expressions and how they're configured. So I click on labels, styles, paste, and labels is available because that's the one I copied. And now when I, when I zoom in, I should get my labels and there you go. There's one last thing though. When I, when I display my other, um, layer let's just get rid of selection this main layer you can see actually it's slightly transparent the, the opacity's um, changed there so you know this is a much garish color so again if you're doing them individually and not done a sort of all style where everything's copied in one go you'll see down here is rendering so how was how was this layer rendering so that's scale visibility it's got the pop-up there scale visibility opacity, simplification, that sort of thing. So I click on rendering and now I just do paste rendering. And there you go. So in just a few clicks, um, I've got exactly a sort of copy of all the symbology, labeling about everything. So the label rules, the template, the expression, the um, zoom scaling as they come on, the rules where the label sits, coloring, um, the opacity, it's, it's all there in just a couple of uh, copies and pastes and certainly don't forget you know I c you can just go copy style and then just do all 
style categories. So I could have done it in just just two clicks really. But I wanted to go through individually just to show you. And then with paste style you see you just paste them all and it will all it will copy everything about, including map tips, um, any relations going on, any separate custom legend settings. So it's again it's just a little feature that's in um, uh, QGIS but uh, very handy, very powerful when you're you know, working on extracting data and someone's spent a lot of time and effort on label expressions, rules, filtering, um, opacity, uh, all, all, that, all that kind of thing. So you can literally just copy and paste. I hope you find that useful. Thank you.